All right, so I got my glucosamine pills for my knees, Superfed for my sinus infection, and my energy and metabolism vitamins. What's up, YouTube? So today, I decided that I'm gonna do the Delaney Walker challenge. I got one of my clients at work who's gonna attempt it with me. I'm on my way now. I'm excited. It's gonna be tough, but let's go. Okay. So due to the fact that I haven't been out of my boot for long, um, even though my foot doesn't bother me anymore, I mean, I can even make it through the full day without it tensing up. I know for a couple of weeks now, I'm sorry, I've been gone for a couple of weeks. Um, I've been able to walk around without the boot, but the muscles around the outside of the foot going under the heel, same spot I hurt, the muscles would tense up real bad and get really tired. So I've only been able to make it through the full day without any of that for about three days now. Now there's two versions of the Herschel Walker Challenge. The first one is you can do a thousand push-ups thousand sit-ups, thousand yards of sprint. And seeing as I just now got back to walking comfortably, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do a thousand yard sprint. So I'm going with option two, which is 1500 push-ups and 1500 sit-ups. Now I have all day to complete this, but I'm gonna try to at least get to 500 and 500 before I leave this morning. Ideally, if I can get halfway done in the morning, that'd be great. I mean, I'd have two thirds of the day to finish the rest. But let's see how this goes. I'm about to go get after it. Alright, so it's like 7.30, I'm at 300 of each, um, I kind of got broken up, did 125 in my first hour, and then I only got 50 in my second hour, and I just did 125 again this hour, so I'm trying to get to 500 before 9 o'clock, because my goal is 500 push-ups and sit-ups by 9, and then after that I'll do 100 every hour until I get to my number. It's getting rough on me though already. I can't believe this man used to do 3,000 of each. That's ridiculous. Woo! So, first off, hats off to Herschel Walker. The guy is a beast. Now, I already knew this. Guy's a Hall of Fame running back, stud of an athlete. I mean, he was in his mid 40s knocking people out in MMA. But I did not know his challenge was going to be this hard. My goal was to be at 500 by 9 a.m. I'm at 450. But let me tell you, my chest is smoked. I can't even complete a set of 25 no more. I'm breaking it up 15 and 10. And 25 sit-ups at a time takes an eon. Oh, my God. Why didn't he pick crunches or something? Ah, oh, it's terrible. Uh, not even a third of the way there yet. But I'm really close. So kudos to him for doing 3,000 of each, and I'm trying to do 1,500. Can't stop now, got a long way to go. I know I'm gonna need me some fuel though in order to keep this up. I mean, gassed already, haven't eaten today, so have me a quick protein shake to feed my muscles so I can keep pushing through. Formix, cinnamon toast crunch flavor. They named it something else, but it's delicious. And my Punisher cup. All right, the goal is a thousand by two o'clock, and then I can do another five hundred by six. That's the goal. Let's see. All right, so let me back up real quick. So for those of y'all who don't know, because I realized I'm in a generation where people are starting not to know some of the great athletes. I mean, I had a conversation with kids and. They didn't know who Terrell Owens and Jerry Rice 
and Randy Moss were. So anyway, Herschel Walker is a Hall of Fame football player and an icon in the NFL. Um, and he had many records and many great feats, but that isn't what made him so great. Well, let me rephrase that. That is part of the reason he was great, but it was the work that he did leading up to the NFL that really has continued to live on just as much as the accomplishments that he had on field. Which meant for him hitting the floor and knocking out some push-ups. That's 500, by the way. And of course... Sit-ups also. You know, that's actually remarkably impressive because the guy became a beast off of push-ups, sit-ups, sprints, and pull-ups. Now, um, after searching around, I found there's two different versions to this challenge. First one being 1,000 push-ups, 1,000 sit-ups, 1,000 yards of sprints. But considering I just got out of the boot not too long ago, it's safe to say that sprints are out of the picture. So I went with challenge number two, which was 1,500 push-ups and 1,500 sit-ups. Now, the crazy thing is, for both of those challenges, the number's only half of what he did. But you have to do 1,500 instead of 3,000 because, of course, the guy had to build up to it. But with that being said, that is still super impressive that this man not only had the time, but the willpower and the muscle endurance to do 3,000 sit-ups and 3,000 push-ups a day. A day, which means he did it multiple days. I'm sitting here now at 500 of each, and my chest is screaming at me, and my core is melting. But you have 24 hours to complete this challenge. I'm going to keep pushing through. I was a little bit off my goal, which was... 500 by 9, and then I wanted to do 100 every hour after that, and I should have been done around 6 or 7 or so. Now I'm a little bit behind schedule, so I'm going to keep pushing to see how far I can make it. So, I'm now at only 600, but my wrist is starting to bother me. It's uh, hurting right down the side of it, um, especially when I'm doing uh, standard push-ups. So I started trying to mix up the variation, do some staggered arm push-ups, some knuckle push-ups. Whew, uh, my tailbone is getting a little sore from all the sit-up motion. Dude, stop crying. My dog's mad because he's in the cage. But he won't let me do my push-ups and sit-ups, so I had to put him up. But I'm tired. This man did 3,000, and I'm aiming for 1,500. Ah. Oh. All right. It's 2 o'clock. My goal is to be at 1,000 by 2. But it's safe to say I'm not there. I'm at 700. I've never done this many push-ups at once, so I never took into account the level of fatigue that I would experience. Um, I'm struggling to get in sets of 10 now. So... It's a lot tougher than I thought. I'm not gonna be done by six o'clock, that's for sure. All right, so now it is 8 p.m. I'm at 850 push ups. This is ridiculous. I had to take a break to stop and do something. It took a few hours out of my day, which really put me behind. Um, Y'all will see that on the next episode, but anyway. So, I think I'm going to call it at 1,000. Hirsch Walker is amazing. For him to be able to do 3,000 is just mind-blowing. I can't even do 1,500. Now, I did have time constraints, but still, I am wore out here. Um, I'm even further behind on my sit-ups. I'm at 700 on sit-ups. So, my goal is to get to 1,000 on push-ups, 1,000 on sit-ups. That's my goal. That's what I'm shooting for. And I'm going to have to pull the plug there. 
It is now 9.22 p.m. I've hit my 1,000 mark on my sit-ups. I am 10 away on my push-ups, 10 away from 1,000. Had to let y'all see it. My wrist is hurting so bad now that I've completely abandoned standard push-ups and gone to straight knuckles, so my knuckles are pretty raw too. I'm doing 140 push-ups on them. Here's my last 10 to reach the 1K mark. One thousand push-ups, one thousand sit-ups. Hershey Walker challenge. Bam.